More than 2,000 people are getting checked and taken off a cruise ship that's now docked in California after some crew members and passengers were diagnosed with the coronavirus. A central Illinois couple is waiting on that ship. WCIA 3's Jen Lask is live in Champaign. Jen, you spoke with them. What do they say to you? Well, Christy, their cruise ship was supposed to go from San Francisco to Hawaii and back, but that's not really what ended up happening. Instead, the ship was held for several miles off the California coastline, while dozens of people on board with flu-like symptoms were tested for the coronavirus. Nineteen of those were diagnosed with the coronavirus, and the cruise was finally given the green light to come into a port in Oakland yesterday, as opposed to last week when it was supposed to come into port, and waves of passengers are now getting off getting medical examinations and being moved into quarantine at military bases across the country. Barb May tells me she and her husband are waiting to learn which base they'll be sent to before they can return to Bloomington. The flight of us, I mean, like how, like probably my biggest fear is how I'm going to be treated once we come back in the general public. Just because we have, we were on this ship. Uh, really, we're fine. The may say they haven't shown symptoms, and they say they're texting with other people on board but have been isolated in their cabin. They don't even see crew members when they bring food to the passengers. They say that they've been warned they've probably got another day or so before their wave of passengers is allowed to get off of the cruise ship. Live in Champaign, Jen Lask, WCIA 3, your local news leader.